All right. So today what I want to talk about um, is I have some poems and a meditation on peace because I think that's a great way to start the week. Let me just pause everybody. Hang on. Mute all. So let's just take a breath and I'm going to read this verse and then we're going to go into our meditation. So let's just Ah, take a minute and sit and take a deep, calming breath. Just a deep, peaceful breath as we contemplate this new day, this new week, this complete opportunity and potential that is ahead of us to be peaceful, to be loving to be present and joyful and just shine the lights that each one of us is. As you take a deep breath all the way down to your belly, sit as straight as you can with your feet on the floor and your hands just resting gently in your lap, lining up all those chakras all the way down from the crown chakra all the way down, letting that energy flow. As you take a deep, peaceful breath in all the way down to your belly, feeling your belly rise and then gently release. Breathing in peace. Breathing out calm letting your mind rest, letting your awareness shift from doing to simply being. As you listen to this beautiful poem called For Peace by Maya Angelou. Father, Mother, God, thank you for your presence during the hard and mean days, for then we have you to lean upon. Thank you for your presence during the bright and sunny days, for then we can share that which we have with those who have less. And thank you for your presence in the holy days, for then we are able to celebrate you and our families and our friends. For those who have no voice, we ask you to speak. For those who feel unworthy, we ask you to pour your love out in waterfalls of tenderness. For those who live in pain, we ask you to bathe them in the river of your healing. For those who are lonely, we ask you to keep them company. For those who are depressed, we ask you to shower upon them the light of hope. Dear creator, you, the borderless sea of substance, we ask you to give to all the world that which we need most, peace. So as you breathe in deeply all the way down to your belly and gently release, just rest in that awareness of the peace that is at your center, the peace that is always there and always available. May I be at peace. May my heart remain open. May I be aware of my true nature. May I be healed. May I dwell in the breath of God.
So as we return our awareness to our surroundings, your room, your office, wherever you are, just take a deep breath and stretch and smile, keeping that peaceful center. No one is going to stay with you all day as you continue to breathe and just remain aware that it's there and available. As you take a deep breath and stretch, move around a little bit. So my second reading is um, Nan Merrill's articulation from her book, Psalms for Praying of Psalm 128, which is about peace. So I invite you to listen. Blessed are you who reverence the beloved, who walk in love's way. Radiate an inner joy and peace wherever you go. Compassion draws you to the gates of those in need. Families and friends gather upon your doorstep. Children run to greet you with open arms. Yes, blessed are you who reverence the beloved. Strangers feel at home in your presence. The oppressed are comforted by your support. Blessed indeed are you who reverence the beloved. Peace is within you. So for those listening later, thank you so much for joining us. And we will see you next time.